This staff form is called Red Dragon Staff Form Number Two. It comes in at our second degree black belt level. It's gonna be a combination of mostly traditional grip this time instead of our normal switch grip like our first form, but it does have a couple switch grip elements. So starting from a regular grip, Staff's gonna start underneath our arm in our attention position. Step out into your regular chumbi. First two movements, we're gonna hit our left and right front 45s. So I'm gonna to turn to my left and do a crane stance and low block. Hop over to the right, step into my downward swing into my horseback stance. Then from here, I'm gonna look back to the front, slide the right foot in, chambering the staff on the left, step back and punch. So with a little flow, From here, I'm going to step with my left foot before my right uppercut, followed by two punches. I'm going to transition into a cross leg stance. Just twist my hips, low block. Left hand is close. If you kept your left hand on, it's going to be really hard to turn the hips. So we're not bringing it all the way back. We're not chambering it. We're just keeping it close to the staff. From here, we're going to re-step into a horseback stance with a big downward swing. Regrip it again on that left hip. Punch out into our front stance. From here comes our first key up. We're gonna perform our left front kick with a key up. Yes! Land in a front stance low block and immediately slide over to the right in our horseback stance. So we're gonna bring our right foot in towards our left. Forward figure eight motion. Switch your left grip. From here, we're gonna do a switching hands figure eight just one time. Left hand to right hand. Followed by behind the back. From this position, we're gonna turn, do a single whip spin over into a left punch. Oh yes, and key up. From here, we're gonna bring our staff back over our head, regripping, left palm towards our face. We're gonna step while we feed it around the back, bring it back over the head into a single punch. Left hand stays on your right shoulder, either open hand or closed hand. And we're gonna turn back to our right into a fighting stance, single high strike. As you do the high strike, you're gonna be in a fighting stance, pull your left elbow away from your staff. Not back like normal, because you will hit your staff. We're gonna pull it away from our staff to make sure it's chambered, but also not getting hit by the back end of our staff. Yes! From this high strike position, we're gonna pull our staff in towards our chest to create some momentum and perform a right leg tornado kick. Drop right back into our fighting stance, right back into our high strike. We're gonna pull the staff down Regrip it into our traditional grip. Stepping with the left foot into a figure eight motion. We're gonna catch the staff under the arm. Regrip with the left, front kick. Staff comes up, grip the bottom, slide into our staff slam. So I'll show you that with a little bit of flow. From our high strike, bring it down, figure eight, kick, and slam. From here, we're gonna grab the tip of our staff with our fingers, we're gonna stand up, bring up the staff, catch the back end, regrip, pull it back, uppercut, into a spinning jab, and key up. From this jab position, we're gonna look over our right shoulder, turn into a fighting stance, and execute a right low block. Switch your right grip so your palm is up. We're gonna spin over our left shoulder into a horseback stance, feed the staff around the body. Right hand is gonna grab tip of the staff, palm facing you, and pull in a pressing motion, so not too fast. Baseball bat swing, 360, and re-grip. From here, we're gonna perform our 360 high strike, so one step with the right into our 360 motion. Figure eight, 360. Landing in your horseback stance. From this position, I'm gonna hop back to the center line into a crane stance, perform my low block, slide into my jab. This next part is gonna be reverse figure eights into a spinning slam. So I'm gonna look over my right shoulder with my right hand, start my reverse figure eight. One, two, as three comes up, I'm gonna do my 360 jumping motion again, left foot followed by right, and turn into a forward figure eight. So up, forward figure eight, staff comes up, let go of your right hand, grab the tip, and slide down right into your slam once more. From here, use your fingers, grab the tip of your staff, bring it up, pull it back, figure eight motion, and burrow. This is a side view of our finishing slam. So we're starting from our cross leg stance and our jab. 
Reverse figure eight three times into your spinning slam. One, two, three, take off, re-grip, and slam. Done a little quicker, it would look like this. Yes! We're going to start in our attention position. Step out with our left foot and chumbi. Turn to our left 45, low block, hop low block, downswing. Slide in, step back, left punch. Uppercut, punch, punch, low block into the cross leg, downward swing. Punch out. Yes! Front kick, key up, low block, low block in a horseback stance. Behind the back spin, into our one handed whip spin, key up, yes! We're going over the head, re grip, behind the back, single punch, high strike. From your high strike, perform your right leg, tornado kick, and another high strike in the fighting stance. Figure eight, kick, and slam. Pop up the staff, pull it, oh yes! Uppercut jab with a key up. Turn to your fighting stance, low block. Switch your grip, feed it around your body, and re-grip. Pull slowly in your pressing motion, baseball bat, figure eight, 360 high strike. We're gonna hop back, crane stance, into your cross leg. Moving back, reverse, one, two, three, hop, oh yes! And slam. Regrip it, bring it up, figure eight, oh yes, and you're done.